I gotta ask you a question. Is nostalgia an old man's game? Is it? I, I'm, I'm 61 years of age now. Uh, I don't know why people fib about their age. If you're gonna fib about your age, add years to it. Tell people you're 75 and they go, you look great, okay? Is nostalgia something that younger people can appreciate? Does, does the five-year-old go, you know, I remember when I was four. These pieces come to us from Mr. Christmas and they do nostalgia extraordinarily well. Their company was based, family owned and operated, still is, same family, uh, in 1933. And they created artwork all the way back then. This one happens to be in our ceramic hurricane. They call it the red because of the base in the top. But, it, but it's a village scene. There's the covered bridge. These are all cutouts in ceramic. I've got about 800 in the red. But I do also have a blue choice that I could show you on qvc.com, uh, and there's about 350 of those. That's their nostalgic snowman design. <laughs> and then we have a green choice, which this was before, before Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. They did an adorable reindeer print, and here it is reestablished once again in their green. Now, what lights this up? It's not a candle. Candles are fine, but candles are dangerous. So they've got their own nice strand of fairy lights on the inside that operate on three AA batteries. And they've got a little timer built in so you don't have to worry about them. And you just put them in, turn them on, and you get this starry night approach to either in red, the village scene, or the blue with our snow people. We gotta be politically correct. Or, or our reindeer. Now Andrea Corbo that you saw on the very first video is with us. She's with us joining uh, by Skype. Oh, you've got all three there. That looks fantastic. How are you? Oh, I'm doing great, Dan. How are you doing? Good. I, I look forward Good. to this every year. Yeah, I know. It's that great Christmas in July kickoff in June. In <laughs> so June. We're so happy to be back together again. And it's just so much fun to reconnect with our favorite people. I love being in your show. So thanks for having me with something really special from Mr. Christmas. Now, and I want to point out, because sometimes the viewers don't know these things, Okay, you and I work in a world of television. <laughs> People don't understand the dedication of our guest on air. To build the spirit, the atmosphere of Christmas, Andrea set up a tree in her living room in June, which means her neighbors think she's crazy, and she's sitting in front of an open <laughs> fireplace when it's 95 degrees out. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's dedication. I love that. I did turn the air conditioning temperature down just a little bit. <laughs> the na the neighbors are Honestly, seeing smoke coming out of the chimney and see a Christmas tree. <laughs> they just think she's lost her mind, which is part of the fun. <laughs> we are the most festive house in the entire neighborhood. And it's partly due to the fireplace on in the middle of June, but it's definitely due to the amazing products that I get to work with and the amazing vendors. And Mr. Christmas has been bringing so many gorgeous pieces into my home and into so many of your homes for so many years. Yeah. They're a third generation family owned company. And you know, nobody does vintage artwork like Mr. Christmas and they've built it into these beautiful hurricanes. I love how you gave the demonstration with those light strands. And you know, if I could point out that they have the option to do either the steady or the twinkle, yes. and it's so easy to switch that right here on the battery box. You can just flip that switch and change it from the steady to the twinkle. To the twinkle, there is a six-hour timer built in, regardless of which way you choose to run them. Or you know, you could take them out, like you said, put a flameless candle in there. there you go. It's just a really special piece, and you can do so many things with it, and and use it pretty much anywhere in your home. Yeah, uh, we have a, a little sideboard table. Uh, my entryway is all Mr. Christmas, and it, it didn't start out to be a theme, uh, but it had to be because I've got one of uh, Leslie Hermanson's carousels in there. And so you walk into my house after 4.30, 5 o'clock in the afternoon at Christmas time, because it's dark, and this resides on the sideboard table. And it does look like starlight. Even just the perfection of the color of the battery-operated lights. It has that kind of an incandescent yellowish glow to it, as opposed to that uh, perfect white that is yeah. the LEDs of today. 
And the price on this is really remarkable. Andrea, I don't remember it ever being under $25. No, I don't think it was. I, I mean, that's what's so special about these Christmas in July sales is that you yeah. get to collect some of your very favorite pieces and add to your collection um, at amazing values. And truly, all three of these are so, so beautiful. And each one is different. So like we said, the red one has that theme with the sled and the barn in the back and the covered bridge. That's such a classic country landscape that we, yeah. we see in movies, we see in TV shows on, on that channel that just runs movies for the holidays 24 7 for the entire month of december that's pretty much an iconic scene in every one of those films but and then, then the blue in the blue snowman yeah. yeah and of course the, the snowman's got a girlfriend because look <laughs> all girls like a well-dressed man it's a zz top i don't well, know why the top hat went out of fashion i might bring we that back bring it back you should yeah. bring that back I, yeah. You could do it. You could pull it off. <laughs> then, I don't know about that. And, uh, I love I this little deer. Because, yeah. again, when this was created, this was before Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, yeah. before Clarice, remember her? Yes, uh, of course. And, and it just looks like a bygone era. It's like an old Christmas postcard. And to have these pieces in your house is wonderful. I, it doesn't matter how old you are. For some reason, you never hear about the good future days. It's always the good right. old the days. The good old days. Right? That's so, so true. Yeah, I mean, that little reindeer was on the little book that I would read as a, as a child. And in this scene, the reindeer is just surrounded by some woodland friends, little birds, those snowy trees. I mean, it's such a sweet scene, something that, you know, I imagine this piece would be something that a, a, a grandchild or a child would see and would just yeah. be mesmerized by, you know, staring at the lights coming through those star cutouts in the ceramic would just be magical. Uh, Andrew's gonna be with me all throughout the show. We're gonna pop back and forth, say hi, talk to each other, have some fun. I'll see you in just a little bit, my friend. Sounds good, see you then. From Home Reflections, this is their wood